I can hear you two decks up. I'm up and trying to sleep. I can hear you upstairs. Really? Yes. Pack this up. Hit the sack, please. Thank you, Cap. I'll do that right now. Sorry, Cap. Not only am I getting woken up a second time, it's threatening behaviour I'm hearing, yelling and screaming. Oh, oh, this is wonderful. This is unacceptable on my boat. I want to see you. Watch a movie now. Yeah, I'm waiting for you. Well, you're not falling asleep here. Well, then put it on. Dad. Oh my god. Oh no, it's my phone. Beautiful day. Good morning. So bad. You all right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm all right, yeah. Rock and roll, rock and roll. Thinking about last night, I'm not feeling like I handled it all too well. A lot of things on my mind, a lot of things stressing me out. Oh. She had the kid and moved to Alaska. Oh. When's the last time you saw her? Oh, I've never met her. I could be sad, I could be mad, but every time I see you, I just end up being glad. Dude, you're getting so cheesy with it. I can't have people on deck who can't tell me what the is going on. I wasn't set up the way that I wanted to. But be. not enough time is not an excuse. But uh, yeah, it doesn't excuse how messy things were. I could have handled it better, for sure. Yeah, that weird dream was not in terms of the Yeah, that's good. Yeah, I did actually. Yeah, I had a fing beautiful sleep. How did you go? Great sleep. Good. Yeah. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah! I'm well happy for you, brother. <laughs> What'd you do last night? Um. Okay, I got my answer. Yeah, exactly. I heard you come down, and Jared was yelling at you. Yeah, there's a bit going on there, Benny. I wasn't unaware of the fact that I'd made a mess. Before I even had the opportunity to try and tidy it up, he was a mess. Oh, weirdo. Great. Kyle, Kyle, Kerry, can you please come up to the bridge? Oh. Yeah, I'm on my way. Well, then it's going to be me. There's a lot going on last night that I didn't see. What I did see was two guys talking loudly in the crew mess, to me, it seemed like Kyle was trying to de-escalate the situation. Jared has had a history of getting drunk and bad manners. I understand he's gone through shit, but I don't have time for it. Good morning. Good morning, Captain. When I finished talking with Kyle, I want to have a chat with you about last night. OK. <sighs> you go, mate. Morning, Captain. Right, I, I need you to be honest to me. Yep. Not hold anything back. Yep. All right, I want to know the facts of the evening. What happened? Ah. Uh... So Jared, had, I'd left a mess upstairs, right? But we were all out drinking, right? Give me a chance to get up in the morning and correct my wrong. My roomie, whatever, left my room. Mm -hmm. So Kyle was like, I'll just bunk with you. Yeah. Which, me and Kyle are super good friends, so yeah. I had no problem at all with mm -hmm. it. Jared then came into and stormed into Barbie's room. Which, you know, give a knock. At any point, did you feel threatened? It wasn't directed towards me, so I didn't feel threatened. Was there threatening behavior? Directed uh, towards you? Slightly, yeah. More of a angry, demeaning manner. He was angrier than what he needed to be. Was he panning drinks last night? Alcohol was involved. We all had a fair bit to drink. I'm not throwing anybody under the bus, yeah. I think it was more like a personal thing. You know what I mean? He was mad that Kyle was in my room. I don't know. Thanks again, Kyle. Thanks, Thanks Cheers, man. <sighs> I don't want anybody to be in trouble, man. Yeah, me neither. I hope Kyle's all right. Cat. Huh? You OK? 
I felt alone, you know? Yeah. Like, I, I know I'm, like, are surrounded by people, but, like, I'm not comfortable. That's what I say about chatting. You're, like, never alone, but always lonely sometimes. Yeah. Good morning, Captain. How are you today? Doing Captain sh Yeah, I know, damn. I'm quickly running out of options with Jared. He's made quite a few ups. He's released heavy equipment at the dock with our permission. Now it's ready to drop. Go down. What the He's made several mistakes in docking. Someone call these wankers. I need distance to stern. Hold the steady. steady. Oh, 25 meters, is, uh, 30 meters to stern. I'm sorry, 30 meters to stern. Get a fender, get a fender. Fenders! What are you doing? And the alcohol doesn't help at all. This morning, you're either still drunk or you're hungover, and I don't want a person in a leadership role doing that. End of the day, my primary responsibility is safety of the vessel and the crew. And this guy is really creating a problem for me.